what's up you guys so i've been wanting to do a video of my kayak and the fishing rods that i take with me when i go out fishing uh, kind of like my setup and what type of kayak i use i mean so let's go over that i'm gonna start with the front hatch this is my kayak it's a 2017 hobby pro angler 14. uh it was a demo kayak so i got it at a decent price i saved a few grands on it so it was an awesome deal so let's start with the front hash right here this thing i use as a uh, sail pretty much sometimes when i'm going towards the wind it works great so so i used to carry um a cooler back there and i just i don't know i wasn't happy with it i decided well my friend mike with daily life give me the idea of putting like a bag in here so i bought a cooler bag from walmart five dollars and i keep my eyes in there with my drinks and my fish and let me tell you guys it lasts me all day maybe because it's in there it works great but also i keep my dry bag shum bag uh, my flag pole and light everything my leaders my uh, fish ruler everything is in there i love that about this kayak this thing is huge um this thing is freaking awesome i have the reverse on it and uh, i love it servicing it though is kind of hard there's like 400 pieces in there and you got to take them all out but uh, it's great uh here this other hash you can have the option of a bucket that they sell for here for like 22 bucks but i kind of like this setup right here i can keep all my soft plastic as i have it right there and here i get my plano boxes so it's pretty cool whatever i need is right in front of me so i can change things up real quick uh right under there i got the wires for my fish finder and my battery for my fish finder this is a milwaukee 12 volt battery and that's just a regular plug from a household appliance uh came up with that that way i didn't have such a heavy battery this thing lasts me a day or two depends on how much i use it and uh it's great guys this this works out great i'll make another video on how i did this so that's that this sit right here to me takes the price i have adjustable uh back right here and also this here i can raise it up or down right here it's all the way up and you see how i brought it all the way down there oh actually this comes up um it works great also long bar support right here on the back I love that picture for a long day in the water. Um, my wife brought me some beer. Thank you. Uh, what else? Okay. I got this little rubber packets right here. I don't use them much except for my pliers and my scissor and stuff like that. They're great. My hobby cup holder, which I use mostly for that. I put all the stuff that I take out of my... Uh, rod and whatever i just put them in there and they stay in there pretty well so not complaining also i make these rod holders it comes with flush mounted uh flush rod holders but i made this one because i want my reels above the water as much as i can and that's my kid he has to ruin it but he'll be a fisherman for sure look at that so, so yes guys the other thing i like about these kayak is the rut setup that they did here i can have six ruts sitting right here on the side completely out of my way and it goes the thick of them go in there they could be up to like a foot long um, so I every time I go I have three on this side and three on that side and they're completely out of my way 
But yeah, it's a 14 footer. The one thing about this kayak is how heavy it is. I think it's 128 pounds without the seat on it. Just the kayak by itself. So it gets heavy at times. Sometimes I get my wife to help me or my friend. Guys, I wanna go over the fishing rods that I bring with me when I go on the kayak and the rails. This right here is a Finor 2500. And I had this thing for like, I don't know, four years and it's still kicking. Uh, it's small, but it's great for like pompanos and things like that. I use that one a lot. And that right there is another Finor uh, LT40 Lito. And I had it for like two years. I beat it, I dropped it in the water and uh, it's still going. And it's one of my favorites actually. Uh, there I have a uh, Spin Fisher 5. This is a 4500. And I use this one a lot for bottom fishing. Uh, just like that one there, that's a Spin Fisher 5 5500 with a little bit of a heavier rod. I use this one for like bigger snook and stuff like that, like cut ladyfish. Um, I haven't had much luck on it, to be honest. And right there I have a pen slammer. That's a 3500 and a pen slammer 4500. And this is my favorite setup right here. I have it pair up with a calico jack. Um, got, I think it's 7.9. And I use this one for freelining shrimp, pinfish, and things like that. And it's my go-to. I use this like all day long. And yes, I bring all six of them on my kayak. You might think that's a lot, but it doesn't bother me because they sit right there on the side, three and three. And I don't, I don't mind them. It's perfect. That's one thing I like about this kayak. But uh, yeah, that's my setup. And. Well, stay tuned for more videos. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe.